Jumbotron ish popping Lil Yachty version. This is the reference track for Drizzy. Say it's not so again. Because twice I remember quitting. God, this song's such a hit. But it's a shit at my I just pulled me off the phone, kind of take sand. Run around my F and N like the whole hands. I said so much last time, it's hard to lead a bit. Then I did the whole kind of tech in a core. If I tell this bitch to pull up, she gon' mope hit it. My dog, you don't smoke on shit unless it's unlit. I'm back and forth. Wait, wait, what's going on? Yachty. Wait, what just. Yeah, have you heard the original of this? Dun 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 I ain't even trying to Bro wait Yachty Yachty how did you Wait Yachty how did you manage? We go we gonna let that bitch rock out of Yeah are y'all wait Taco Bell ass nigga wrong with it <laughs> Street niggas everywhere like Taco Bell. <laughs> I just pulled me off the phone, kind of take sands. Round around my F and N like the whole hands. I said so much last time, it's hard to lead a bit. Then I did the whole kind of tech in a core. If I tell this bitch to pull up, she gon' mope hit it. My doggy don't smoke on shit unless it's unlit. I don't back and forth over no net, so just gon' dead it. See me when you see me, and if it's smoke, doggy unleash it. So first off, I actually somehow. Y'all gonna get mad at me because I have a lot of Drake haters in my comments, which is totally fine. I don't really care. I don't mean that nigga don't pay me none. But I'm a real nigga. Y'all remember Quentin Miller's um I was running through the six with the woes, bro. It didn't even sound like a song. And now we're hearing little Yachty's Jumbotron pop and shit, and it, it sounds like he has something caught in the back of his throat. And, ah, man, I like auto-tunes. I really do like what it does and it just, like, evol evolving music. But, like, Jesus, y'all, y'all, listen to... Yeah. Yeah. And then Yachty changed the, the lyrics. See, Drake talking about my homie was too dripped out. He ain't leave the bed. Yachty talking about I'm too drinked out. Boy, come on, Yachty, with your addictions. That's why yo shit didn't sound like Drizzy. We ain't even out in Turks, you finna take sand. Yo. Riding around with F and then we like the whole hand. Yo. Two sip, nah, he ain't lead a bear. Then I did the pint of tech in a cold red. red. If I tell this bitch to pull her, she gon' mo petty. My doggy don't smoke on shit. Unless it's a lady. Hold on. No nah, Drizzy, stop doing this. I will say this speaks to the incredible talent of Drizzy Drake Marley. This depicts the incredible talent of, but it's not rapping talent. It's performative talent, maybe? It's how do you keep getting these garbage songs that you know and I know? If you heard this, a nigga goes, this is going to be the lead single off your album, and they sent you this. My dog, you don't smoke on shit unless it's unlit. I don't back and forth over no net, so just go and it. See me when you see Thank you under that. Doggy, unleash it. Thick rock and bitch, that's my fate. I'm not going to beat it. I'm kicking you out the studio. Fuck is you talking about? A nigga come with that. We kicking you out the studio. What the fuck is this? So, I mean, we ain't using a reference track, but you understand what I'm saying? I'm kicking you right out the goddamn studio. My thing about this is this doesn't even make any sense. Like, Drake is able to hear such flaming hot garbage and make it into a hit. Now, that just goes for the, the what I use this song for, right? That's, we sipping before we go to the club. Man, I'm riding around. We hoop and we catch it. It's just a catch a vibe, bro. Right? But right now, the reason why this reference track coming out is such a, to Drake just karate trap to cuss, throat, pause. Is because, bro, where is your artistic integrity? Now, yes, it's a it's a fun, dope song, and I, I it wasn't originally. I ain't gonna hold you. This shit miserable. Listen to it. Looking in that mirror, kiss my face. I'm too cunty. Wow. Said that bitch home. This nigga said, "Wow." <laughs> Yo, no. What niggas don't know is like, you know, you gotta be careful that company you keep. This nigga Drizzy always been the light-skinned nigga from Toronto. We've always made jokes about him. But once he started doing the fingernails, wearing the brats, doll hair, the brats, the fingernails, talking about he needs to get a facial, which is like, clean your face, cuz. But it got so goddamn flexible, you could have made the Olympics. And that is because you're with Yachty. That boy Yachty on a different kind of, of wavelength. I don't... But that's that. This 
wrestling about. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing wrong with that. But boy, this was weird timing. This was really weird time. But I wonder if Kendrick and Metro actually saw this as, okay, he did that weird, like, dance album, house music, and then he does, we have this. He's not in hip-hop right now. Bro on his pop star run. And the thing about Drake is, I will say, you can't have your cake and eat it too. Either you're going to be the pop star or you're going to be the rap star. But you can't mix integrity you can't mix what is acceptable in one with the other because if you want to make pop hits make pop hits you want to make but but all this non-writing shit is like come on bro it's bad for the culture this nigga rapping about vaping i ain't gonna lie even when i heard drake rap about vaping i was like nigga that's not gangster and as a nigga who used to vape, I quit. But like, I'm like, nigga, this is a weird pocket to be in. You know what I mean? Like, just rapping about that nigga got the moochie mango and I blow it out, yo. Like, I don't, just a weird moochie mango bars. Makes more sense when it comes from Lil Yachty. Lil Yachty freaky ass and make a lot more pop. Take like, whole count. Big shit pop we don't want to get you. Niggas try to take a nigga spot, now it's too cramped. Up uh, at a.m. gigging hard, I'm, I'm a, a real vamp. Girl. These niggas got me fucked up, dirt, I'm too amped. <laughs> and this bitch lick me like a male stamp. Strapped up, I give a fuck, I'm That a is hard, though. And it's like the simplicity of that bar. It's not dope like that. But it's just like, nigga, maybe that bitch leave me like a male stamp. And what? Take what? I don't fake shit. I gotta hear his brutes, cause that's my favorite part of the song. Real slime, posted that little crib in a sink pit. Every time, see how I feel, I don't fake shit. Okay, do it wrong with them sticks, we don't do fake. I just pull me up. And I seen, I seen Yachty come out and be like, this shows the bias of hip hop and how. If I put this song out, you wouldn't have you wouldn't have given me my credit, but Drake doesn't do. Dude, don't do that, Yachty. If I came out and started going, Billy Jean is not my girl. She's just the one. Like Billy Jean, not my girl. She's just the one. She's just a girl who said I am the nigga. What are the lyrics that song? But you understand my point. If I'm in here talking it or. Nobody's gonna like it, but if MJ get in there and get to grabbing and gripping, nigga, it's gonna hit. Everybody know that. Take sense. You gotta grab and grip. You ain't gripping the right thing. I said so much last time. It's hard to lead a bear. It's hard to lead a bear. You're going off speech, and then I spent the whole time being in the code red. Listen how Drake did, and I took the whole time to leave. So just gone, did it. See me when you see me. If it's smoke, doggy, unleash. I'm world champ. Boot it up. <laughs> Make this bitch lit me like a mess down. <laughs> Strapped up, fuck it, I'ma die lit. Two Too slow. Closer at the crib in, in the a snake pit. Every time I tell you how I feel, I don't face shit. Okay. Everybody got a stick, we don't run fast. I don't even remember what I played that back for. I'm done listening to Yachty. This was a, not a certified vibe check, but a, a straight disappointment. And I give that like another point in the Metro Booming category. Uh, it's it's about like I don't even know because uh, do you give that Ross one because that Ross one is a W right right now I think Drake has one one W in this beef between his uh, and his response and everything has been against him but we also have to remember it's one verse twenty so if it, it's it makes a weird grading scale it's not gonna be one for one it's gonna be one. Drake diss 10 niggas, then one of them comes back to Drake 10, just another 10, and then one, you understand what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? We're going to see what time it is with Drizzy. Hit that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button, we out of here. Stop getting Ghost Riders, Drake, seriously.